Hello, folks, and welcome back to the fifth instalment of Harvester. Yeah, and possibly the final. Maybe. Um, we're on we the are, third disc now. Yeah, we're on the third disc. We, uh, what we do? We stole the barber's uh, barbershop pole. Yep. Uh, accidentally killed him because we left the wires in water. Mm-hmm. Um, and that was after we got arrested, got taken to jail. Yep. Got stuck, so we reloaded the save and then didn't get taken to jail. Mm-hmm. Um, the powers of time are our toys. You uh, burned down the diner. Yeah, well, yeah. then we we had to burn down the diner. And so Edna, as a result, oh, yes, go on. Edna decided to take her own life um, while the sheriff was eating cherry pie. Um, hmm. We uh, we missed the bake sale, but we went and visited the bake sale after it already happened. So that was. I felt bit... like we didn't miss anything there. No, not really. There was a bunch of people, the the, the same actress as our mum hmm. in like three or four yeah. different outfits. Um, we we finally got into the broom closet door, and we got a baseball bat yes. out of it, which then got taken off us when we went to the lodge. Um, and we got... Stephanie. Oh yeah, We've got so to talk about the, uh, the someone said room. sorry to hear about Stephanie, and we said what. So we went over to the house, and there was just a skull and a spinal cord with one eye mm. uh, on her bed, and an yes. invitation from the lodge. So we took him the invitation. He said, "No, not the bit of card that looks like an invitation. It was the skull and the spinal cord." Which doesn't because, look like an invitation, really. No, I've only been to a couple of weddings. I'm still yet to receive a skull and spinal cord. Yet. Um, so let's. Mm. Um, oh yeah. So we went into the lodge. Um, we said this invitation. He said that's the one, and he let us in. We uh, went. <laughs> through a trap door, slid down into some questionable anus-looking doors. Um, anus with eyes. We uh, we mm. killed a cloakroom attendant who was armed, so we took a shotgun. Yeah. Uh, this is definitely a lot more combat in, in this part of the game. Killed so, a chef. Um, yeah, we killed a chef. Didn't really have to, but we got, a, I think, a meat cleaver. He's very sick, he is. Sick in the head. We it's cut a, him in half, didn't you? The, the point of the I game is it's a satire on video game violence. So if anything, I'm just demonstrating. And that makes so it okay, it's isn't? nothing to do with me as a person. It's mm. purely for the uh, the message of the game. So okay. without further ado, let's... Uh, let's here we go. So we're stuck at the fountain. Um, ah, yes. Right. So I'm clicking on the wrong window here. There we go. Right. So we're in this fountain. And... Apparently... Oh... What have you spotted? The fountain key. We spent ages at this bit yesterday. We did. Uh, going back and forth, different I, ideas. I thought you had to, like, put something into the water. What's that? An odd-shaped hole on a raised surface. Is it a key-shaped hole, perhaps? What, half an hour we spent yesterday piss assing around going back and forth and uh. we've just had energy drinks so that's oh, probably God. why you go whoa hang on get him who the heck oh, is that oh, big dude just hit, him. just hit him hit him get him he's a big dude him isn't he shotgun shotgun oh, I'm saving my bullets I might need him oh there we go <laughs> a bit of a, uh, elongated uh, it was a nice bugger, wasn't he? Oh, yeah. Right, is there anything? Did he have anything on him? No. A power box. Non functioning. A brick. Is there anything behind the board? Just a rotten piece of plywood. Um, is, is that, that an aerosol button? can? Can you get that? No, it doesn't seem to want to let me pick it up. What's that pink button just behind? Uh, it's the power box. Ah. It's um, not functioning. Let's. This is the rope. Let's go up the rope. Oops. Do we have to investigate? So, someone's probably died. It's probably been our fault. Oh, here we go. Who's this guy? Welcome to the Harvest Moon Art Gallery, sir. It's I'm the curator the same of this place. Voices. So delighted you could come. It's young Andy Warhol. Um, can't wait to see what passes for art in this hell hole. Yeah, we, good, Stephen. we've had enough. Yeah. No more playing along, we've had enough. That's always the dilemma, sir. What are the boundaries of art? Only you can answer that, and only for yourself. Lovely works, pastoral scenes, noble sculptures. These are easy on the eye and mind. But when confronted with a work of hideous form, you're forced to deal with it, even if only to dismiss it as trash. Sadly. 
the most extreme works are the hardest to dismiss. Grotesqueries amid works of beauty are necessary. I'm trying to save your wife here. Do you want to uh, wrap it up? Nevertheless, it's yeah, I mean, what are we looking at you? Is that a dummy or a big black black? For no <laughs> reason, I give you permission to obliterate that which forces you to linger too long in the gallery. Sweet! I'm You're causing me to linger too long in the gallery. Were that simple. Kill him. Right. It's all right. Okay. There you go. I'll He's an artist. That right That's art. Right, uh, ooh, left or right? Should we go left first? Sorry, yeah. mate, we could have left you there for a bit longer, but I must say, as much as as funny as Steve's stance is when he's holding a weapon, it makes me fear for his his back because he has he's a very bad hunch. It, it makes me fear for other people, if I'm honest. Yeah, you. that's th three that you've killed. He walks like a cartoon burglar. He actually, oh, hello. oh, oh, <gasps> oh! All right. What was I'm... she made of? I know, but Am she I had okay because I got hit there? See, I've been hit a few times, but my health Ooh. still uh, still good. The artwork that's hanging up was in the dream. The, the, um, yes. It, the, the sliced uh, throat. Oh, God. Could this all be a metaphor? Or a simulation. Mm. Strangely calming. It looks like it was painted with flesh, fr uh, fresh blood. Perversely abstract. Nothing perverse about it. So I think this is. Like cow's looking I at think it. this kind of does it loop around? Does it, oh oh! Right, we've just taken down the silver surfer, his green brother. <laughs> green that door's Gary. locked, so we need a key for that door or something that will open it. Probably not. Heavy and intimidating. Not not in the slightest. Have you been called those things before? Just fat and stupid. Oh, <laughs> that's probably the next piece of art that we see. What is that? That's like some Sid that's, from Toy Story he's come up with. That's from a tool video, that is. Good <laughs> grief. Oh, not that way. Oh, I keep going back. Yeah, I hope that I think it just loops around in a circle. Oh. Sculpture is morbid but strangely erotic. Got a lot of opinions on art, Steve. It adds some yes, uh, Steve, layer of depth to, talk to, to the character. Oh, yeah, it's right, going around yeah. in a circle. Right, so... That's... Well, that's the rope that we can came up Can you go back on. up? <clears throat> oh, you can't get any higher. No. So, let's... So, so is this the a, top floor? There's a door that we need a key. See, we can't actually go to any of these. As, oh, ah, I think, yeah. So, let's, uh, let's carry on round. You can't smash any of the uh, exhibits, can you? I don't believe I can, but we'll... Ooh, I like that picture that he's walking past now. What, the like a triceratops? Sadistic rhino, yeah. yeah. Lovely. Heavy and intimidating. Right. Can't see any like hidden keys on the floor or nah. anything? No. Oh, there's going to be a puzzle with the floor tiles now, isn't it? No, oh, don't say that. It's going to be hidden. It's going to be a black and white key on black and white floor tiles. Right. B-17's in flight. Doesn't know the scale of those ones, does he? I suppose mm. they're one. Full scale. Do you know what was um, so kind of intriguing then? Is that there was a portrait of like, one of like a family. Yeah. If, uh, could they own the lodge? Human jade. I haven't got a key already, have I? I can't. Oh, I've got. Oh, I must have picked up the key off him when I killed him. Ah. Got the key for what though? Yeah, there's a door here. It's probably. Oh! This one. Yeah. Okay then. See, I wish it'd tell you, like, I picked the key up, not... Brace yourself, there's going to be a monster coming out. Well, there will be if we'll go for the door. Maybe not. Right, let's uh, give it a little save. Now we're on, uh, what, the second floor of the lodge. Um, and the wall. Oh. Because I'm murdering everything. Right. Um, let's go through these double doors first. Oh, a library. Can I help you? I'm looking for a girl. This is a library, not a brothel. <laughs> you don't understand. I have reason. She's heard that one before. I yeah. hope to believe that she was brought here. Do you know anything about that? I'm afraid not. I tend to stay out of lodge affairs. I'm only in charge of the library, my good fellow. You work in the lodge. Well, if she is here, she's not been invited as a member. 
There are no female members of the order. To be sure, one you? or two have qualified throughout our history, but they're generally not of our caliber. I doubt there are any females in this building, at least none that are extant. Extant. But you're a woman. I'm not a member. Women are kept here for the services they are able to render. Just as some jobs are beneath men, so too can certain services only be supplied by women. If she is that, here, it was the 50s. Find her on the third floor, which you'll have difficulty finding. Didn't have monsters there on the 50s. Oh, so we need to go to the third floor. You want something in return? I'll give you a clue as to how to get to the third floor, but only if you'll retrieve an overdue book from one of our charter members, a Mr. Kane. Mm. Since he is so highly regarded among the order, I'm loath to approach him on such an embarrassing matter. Therefore, bring me the book and I'll help you. How will I know which book? Oh, you'll know it. He's not an avid reader. Can I help you? <coughs> I'm looking for a girl. I, well, this it's... We're just you don't understand. having this. It's going to be a porn mag. What do you mean extant? What does extant mean? Oh, I see. You're the new initiate. Brilliant. If she is here, you'll find her on the third floor, which you'll have difficulty finding without my help. And yeah, yeah, yeah. We've had this conversation. Okay. How will I? Oh, hmm. right. So we need to find Mr. Kane. And we're gonna we'll kill him because we're gonna just kill him again. Though to be fair. It's an overdue book. He deserves to die, if I'm honest. Yeah. How how overdue? Like, is it a couple of days, or we're we talking? Mm. I I've probably still got books at my mum's house from the late nineties. Wow. From like school libraries. Uh, and do you feel guilty for having them? No. There's a man named Steve. After people like you now. Well. Sixty. He's not going to get any he's clues. Gonna burst in. He's going to come behind us now. With a big sigh. He won't. Not at this rate. He's going. He'll get. It took us nearly a week to get into the lodge. <laughs> yeah. Right? Doors locked. Doors barred from the other side. Right, it's so probably have to go through and then come out. Hmm. Where I'm off guard. Do we come in this way or? Oh. Oh. Very lovely white room. Nice little spider web effect on the trays. Yeah. Eh? Anything we can pick up doesn't appear to. Oh, can we go further down here. Are you Mr. Kane? You can't come in right now. I just mopped the floor. I stuck it with ages. He looks. Oh, what's the guy's. The, Brad Garrett, is it? Hey, buddy, give me a break, will you? Keep up the floor. You feel like everybody loves Raymond or something. He's a really thick, like, New York accent. Hey, buddy. He's, um. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> do you know in Bugs Life, the rhino? The, the rhino beetle? Yes. Yeah, um, I think. Is his, it Brad... his character was Robert, if I remember. I can't Ooh. remember. <laughs> yeah. Like that. Hey, buddy, give me a break. Brad Garrett. Right, I don't like You it. think just because I'm a janitor I got no pride? That's all I got to do all day is clean up after you rich bastards? Take a hike before you get hurt. Kill him. Yeah, we're gonna kill him. Come here. Alright, buddy. You ask for it. Is he on axe? Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. <gasps> Whoa. Hang on, pal! Is that a nail gun? Right. Oh, oh, Steve. Oh, no, right. the picture let's, changes. Let's have a sandwich. Right, it's fine. And then let's have a shotgun. She killed the bastard. Get him, get him! That's it, yeah, oh, you need oh. Grabbing the nail gun, you're right to your inventory, hoping it will come in handy. Oh, it's a little Where victory. A victory him? shot there. All right, so we've got a nail gun. Um, and had to use a sandwich. Can you drink water on that? That's it, I thought just to get some nah. health back. I think I'm all right for health now, because I've, I've had that sandwich, but... Is that the same door we came in, or is this another... Look at him. Getting a bit smug now, aren't you, Steve? Right. He's a bloody murderer now. Oh, that door's oh, locked. nice harp music in the background. Right, so, it looks like there was only the nail gun in here, I can't... Can you pick up the bucket and the brush? I cannot, they don't... ...seem to let me. Um, we'll go back out of this room, because I think, again, it's like a looping kind of corridor. Um, it's a bit kind of disorientating because it's it still is, like actually. because it's still like two D images. What if the artwork described like the layout of the building? Because when we saw the artwork that was looped, maybe it could be the. I don't even know. I'll get back to that. It was an ashtray. Oh, a shotgun shell in the ashtray. Hey. And another shotgun shell in the ashtray. So a couple of free bullets there. What's in this room? Are you? Oh, are you Mr. Kane? He looks like a very good oil painting. 
First place trophy in the Cabinet Makers Union Chapter 501 Special Chess Olympics for differently abled spinal injury victims. That's like those people that are in the Guinness Book of World Records for things that no one would ever yeah. do. He seems chuffed by it though, look oh, at him. Licking the most doorknobs in an hour. Like, yeah, of course you're going to have the record for that, because it's all you that's doing it. Is there any more... Oh, no more shotgun shells in there. I am the chess master. Any initiate who wishes to pass this way must do so over my dead body. Deal. Being a civilized man, I offer my opponents a choice. Solve my problem or fight me to the death. Do you know how to play oh, chess? Oh, this is all you. I'm out. I know how to play chess, but I'm not very good at it. So, oh, if it's like a full chess game now, I'll just shoot him. Mate me and you may pass. Mate you? Oh, checkmate, not... Oh, no. Oh, right. I'll leave this to you, okay? I'll be quiet now. So the knight... He's got a spliff there, though. I don't seem to be able to... All right. Um, oh, is that the tiles I can move to? So, there's his king... So if we move, so a knight can move in like an L shape, so we'll move there. Oh. And then we'll move the king I've, I've out of the way. What? Chess is a civilized oh. game. What? How sad that we must Did I mess it up? I think I messed it up. Civilized form of can I just shoot him? <laughs> What? Oh god! Oh Jesus Christ! You did that! Right. Let's pause for a second. What? <laughs> a giant chess piece attacked me. I think I'm, I must have moved the wrong one. Um. Oh. Oh what? Oh wow. And well, there's oh, the key. Right, so he just oh, he spit right. his face open. Right. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Could have fought back, but I decided not to. What can we get in there? Can't get in the cabinet. Could just started that game again. Yeah. Nobody needed to die then. It, the game wasn't finished. He could have done a move, but it was the incorrect move, and then I could have taken him. But we'll see. At least we can get past him now. Yeah. Um. So. We'll uh, we'll leave this room and we'll carry on this way because this key is probably for one of the doors that we tried to get in before. What's this door? Oh, he's oh, he's a big huge. lad. Oh, it's nice. Oh. I'm out of bullets. Oh, no, I'm not. Oh, oh, man. Oh, man. Can I not? Am I all out? You got a black guy and you're bleeding in your mouth. Oh no. Right, we'll have to go for the scythe. Oh, and he's... oh, he killed me. When did I last save it? Right. Try that again. So. Where did we get to? Alright, oh, so we know we need to help her. So we need to get a book for her. So we'll, we'll go this way around. If we can. Where's... I'm lost already. Oh. Let's, uh... We won't go the other... We'll go the way around we went before. Yeah, let's kill our big yeah, dude. Yeah, get our bearings. Get right, we came through this way. Couldn't get in those doors. We carried on around. We went through here. Right, this is the chess master. Mm -hmm. um, tell you what. No chess. I think you've got to know. Uh. Uh, I don't know how to play chess, so... Yes. Oh. Oh. Yep, cool. Kill himself. Take the key. We've missed... Uh, we need to go back to the... The janitor with a nail gun. Um, oh, actually, I think we'll come back to the janitor with a nail gun, because he did cost me a few shotgun shells. And there are some extra in And we, here. we need to kill the big dude first. Yeah, let's... Uh, oh. I've, have I still got my sandwich? Yes, I've still got my sandwich. Yes. So let's get me shotgun out. Is it this dude? Yes. Oh my god, it's going to take a lot more. Oh there yes! We go. Oh, we found a book. Oh! 
That must That's have been Mr. Kane. Kane. That's gotta be. That's gotta be Kane. Yeah, named after your yes. favourite wrestler. Yes. Mr. Kane's sole material possession since the death of his brother, a stool. Well, technically it was the book as well, but we could just take um, Do you want to save it? Uh, yes. And um, please, that's got to be Kane. It's got to be. We'll call it Kane and Unable. Mm. It's better than yours. Excellent. Um, right, let's go back. Right, we'll deal with... So, Nail think, Gun Kelly now. Yeah, Nail Gun Kelly. Um... Was this the chess master's room? Or, oh no, it was this one. It was through here, wasn't it? That's right, he's there. Yes, How shoot him. Me? Just shoot him. <gasps> oh no. No, no. Oh no. Look, right. you've got Kane, you can't die by him. Right, no. we're still, uh, we're only got a little bit bleeding in a black eye, so let's chop him up. It's annoying because it kind of pushes you. Oh god. It pushes you back, Just doesn't it? Just hit him. Have a Sammy. Oh, oh no. Dead, right. At least we saved it yeah. after Kane, so... I think we might come back to him, see if we can find any more shotgun shells anywhere. Yeah. Cause, uh, He's hard, him. He is a tough bugger. Was that the door we came out of, or is that... Let's see, well, first thing, so we'll go back to the... Library. Library and give, give her the book, because she's going to give us a clue how we get to the third floor of the lodge. Yeah. So... It's kind of disorientating, this this floor, because it it's, it's circular. Um, mm. But again, I think that's... Very good by the game makers. Yeah. So was it this way here? I think it. That was the door we came in. Yes. Right. So let's give her Kane's book. Well, it's not really Kane's book, is it? I'm looking no. for a girl. Yep, we know. Alive. Yep. You don't understand. Yep. I'm. Yep. Just well, give her the freaking book. I'm yes. 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 I'll give. Oh. No. Give her the book. Ah, you've returned the book, I see. Oh, she's happy to Thank you, her. young man. Feel free to look around the library for anything that interests you. You want to give me a clue? You told me you'd help me get to the third floor. Ah, yes. You'll need a special key, which is in the keeping of our resident chess master. Which we've got. Here is your clue. Along with the positions of his pieces, the chess master holds the key to the third level, always in his thoughts. That's the clue? The best that I can give you. I'll write it down for you so that you won't forget. If you don't find this key, I'm afraid you'll never make it any further. Good luck. Um Don't don't bother writing it down. No. We've uh We've done it, love. Yeah. We're gonna take our sweet time now. Right. Um let's We will. We'll go the other way. Well, um, we've got the key. Um, if the only thing we can get from the janitor is the nail gun, and I think that's just another weapon. I don't think it's necessary. Right. Let's speak to this fellow. Yeah. The membership director. Let me see. Oh yes, the new initiate. I'm the large membership director. What can I do for you? The lodge is a traditional place, young man, and by tradition, oh, when a young man is courting a young woman, he wins for her a Cupid doll at the fair. There is no fair within the lodge. However, I have seen a thing which resembles a Cupid somewhere on this floor. Seek it out, slay it, and return here with a prize if you would seek your lady. So we need to find a doll. <laughs> Apex twin artwork on the wall there. <laughs> we take a sword? Oh, decorative. You could probably do some damage with a decorative yeah. sword if you swung it hard enough. What's through this so door? what exactly? It must be a mythical creature then. Oh, dolphins. Oh, it's a lovely piano. Can't play it though. Can we go anywhere in here, around here? There must be a reason why we're in this room then. Yeah. Oh. Can you click? Oh. Click the pillar, what's... Is it something to do with the, the dolphin? Is there something on the dolphin? Don't seem to be anything I can. Could you were um, um list of what you've got? I don't. Can I can I do that in this? Uh, oh, I can. So I've got the key. Right, using the key on the dolphin. Can't actually interact with anything. 
Let's uh, have a look at the other pillar. A hooked flail. I've just picked up a hooked flail. And it's a hooked flail. Is it a weapon? Oh, it's a whip. Oh. Could come in handy. Right. You filthy man. For fighting people off, mm -hmm. not for beating people off. Right. So I'll come out of here. Go back. <laughs> oh. uh, just seeing him with the whip here. He's going to use it on Stephanie. Him. <laughs> Door's locked. Right, can we use the chess master's key on this door? It's the wrong key. Mm. We cannot do that. Um. Was the maybe we do need to get the. Uh, sorry, mate. Oh, he's still there. So his trophies. You sorry for the chess master, though. Why? Well, he, he was, was a sitting knob. There waiting. Didn't even let us waiting finish a game. He to, to come in, and he knew he was going to die. He I killed himself. Oh. I killed his little giant chess piece. Must that be painful having a key in his brain, though. I don't know, you probably don't feel it at all. Oh, can you crawl under there? No. Uh, I can't really interact with this. Is... It's only the stool. Nothing on the light, no. Must have just been here for the book. Let's go back to um, the janitor. Where was the janitor? Was it this way? Um, was it this door? Yes. Mm. No, I still have the, the walls. Excuse me, you can't come in right now. I just mopped the floor. Right, we'll save it here. Jousting with the janitor. Janito. Janito. That's Spanish. For right, let's see how close I can get. Because it's annoying because because he he's got the nail back, gun. Doesn't he? I can't like launch mine. Maybe he's into whips. Okay. Oh, man. Well, that didn't work. How come I've got a. Black eye already was. I thought it was. Oh, I must have been after the big dude. I think it was the uh, the chess piece. Yeah, maybe. Right, let's. Uh... Go just. You think just because I'm a. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, but. <sighs> Whoa! Oh, got him in two. He wasn't as big as the Mr. Kane, though. Right, let's. Bang and the dirt is gone. <laughs> Let's have a look what's past here. Oh, the same. Was the door locked? Was right. Maybe can we use the key to get in this door? Yes. Mm. Is that one gonna be a monster in it? <laughs> it's a clown with a chainsaw. Um. Hmm. Uh, let's whip him to death. He might be into that quick. Go do it, do it, do it, do it. <laughs> right, nail gun. Hmm. Where is the nail? Oh, it's uh, it's on the right. Yeah. How many nails, dog? Oh, oh, there I go. Right. Hopefully, this does some damage. Oh, I need to use the key, don't I? Well, that didn't work. I did now, Steve. There we go. Oh, Grabbing the chain so you're right to your inventory, hoping it'll come in handy. You also find a Cupid doll and something that looks like a key. Right, so we got the doll. Stop in the film. Now, what is a Cupid? Monkey Boy goes ape shit with a chainsaw. The hot, the light holiday children's classic. Let's play Impale the Poor Dumb Hapless Animal with Lawn Darts. The brown I, stains I on the game. outside of this Jack in the Box suggest that you don't want what's packed inside to come spraying out. Do it. Right. Won't let me. Tank of happy gas is plum empty. Plum empty? Just say empty. I, I do like how the clown has died with his legs in the air. Ready for the whips. You know oh, can we get the teddy bear? Is that. Oh. Blood spotted movie screen, or are you back in the art gallery again? Whee. Right, let's uh, 
Let's save it. Call it chapter three. The better one. Yeah. Still haven't seen that, you know. I've not seen the remake. It's rubbish. Not scary yeah. at all. It's that's, too CGI, you know. That's what that I That clown in there was freaky. Yeah, but he had a chainsaw. That is true. I quite like the nail. I think we'll stick with the nail gun for now. Ah, uh, without of nails almost. Yeah, true. But once it's done, I can I'll switch to like the chainsaw. Um, so we will go. Where was the? There was one of the right. Let's try. QP key. Let's try that. Ah, there we go. Let's go in here. See what's in here. Oh, is it? Oh, oh, oh is it a theater? Right. Oh, flags. Flag on a pole. Oh, I can pick up the flag on a pole. Just carrying around a bit of patriotism with me. Right, ah, what's backstage? backstage? Hammer. Can't use the hammer. A range rider lunchbox. Mm. You grab a sandwich. Oh, we've got another sandwich. How are we doing for health, actually? We're... Hmm. I don't think we need the sandwich just yet. It's, it's no. better to use it when you're on like you're nearly dead, and then unless it can... we have two sandwiches though, look. yeah, you get a non-functional prop kitchen. Oh, is that a prop fridge? Because there's nothing in the prop fridge. Staircase. Plank. Oh, we've got a plank. What's that purple thing on the floor? Uh, I don't want to tell what it is. It's just a tin of paint or something. A barrel of grease paint. Right. So, I think if we go back to the uh, with the membership director and uh, give him the the cube cupid doll, whatever the cupid doll. Oh, examine the barrel. Essential theatrical, uh, essential theatrical programs. Oh, what are they on the wall? Two masks hanging on the wall. Hmm. Oh. Oh, it's a game. Did you spin around? Oh. Right. Ooh. Oh, that was a bit of luck, wasn't it? I don't know what, where you would have found that puzzle solution. Yeah. Just clicking randomly. I suppose there's not too many um, outcomes you can have with that. Blood red water swirls behind the glass. Do you know what I've just noticed? What's that? Some of the props we've seen in the streets. Very true. Mm. Right. I don't think there's anything in here. It'll all come out through here. Oh, Stephanie's clothes. <gasps> she's running around naked. <laughs> I think we'd have bumped into her by now if she's running around yeah, naked. Yeah, that's true. He's tied up naked. Oh. That doesn't sound good, so we're going to save it. Eventually. Uh, a wooga. A wooga. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> There's a little nail gun. Pick up that pipe. Oh, pick up the pipe. Oh, I thought <laughs> I thought me picking the pipe off the floor. A pipe wrench. Ah. Ooh, what's a little battery? Um... No, it's a dead battery. What's a little traffic on? But then <coughs> pick that up. It's like a, a pressure valve. The, the one by, oh. almost by his feet. Oh, that one. Oh, no. no. Control valve in the on position. Well, I've... I turned the steam off, but it's still going until I have to turn another one. It's still making a lot of bloody noise. There's another pipe. Oh, oh some bendy man. pipe. Well, that didn't work. Well, that didn't oh, work. No, pipe up. There's a lot of pipe. Do I have to hmm. fashion it together? Is that power meter slash fuse box? Doors locked. Do I have to connect the pipes to the boilers? Is that what it's? Damn it! Oh man, damn it! Use pipe on broken pipe. Okay. Well, that didn't Keep work. walking to the right well, there. Work. Okay. So I've turned that valve, so we must have to like repressurize these boilers or something. Do we have to replace the um the rusted 
uh, valve. Possibly. Um, that's really annoying. Hmm. I feel like we definitely got to put the pipes somewhere. Obviously somewhere. Yeah, otherwise why would they give it to us? Yeah. We have to connect it to... Damn it. Well, that didn't work. Can't use well, the pipe on any well, switch. Work. Oh, man. No. Oh, man. Okay. That was like it's missing a, a straight pipe. Damn it. Hmm. Can I use the pipe wrench on the valve? The valve is stuck solid. Oh shit! <laughs> right. We died again, but luckily we saved it, so we're all good. Well, I really should have kept a death count. It must be on like 10 or 11 deaths by more, now. More, 15 like, We died like what, three times? Four times in like the main yeah. city of Harvest? The lodge, probably like 30. So maybe we turn the cut off when we've like repressurized the boilers or something. So let's go and pick Ooh. up the. Uh, we got the pipe. Because it looks like you can walk up there when it's turned off. Maybe. Okay. That says it's broken pipe there. Rusted hole in it. There's nothing we can. Pipe cannot to... be undone. Oh, do I have. Oh, I just think I just fired it. So can I now. Ah, oh. there we go. So, oh, do I have to rebuild the pipe? Ah. With the broken bits. Well, that didn't work. Well, Pick it up then, work. you knob. Right. He's a jack of all trades, is Steve, no? Oh. A murderer. Just a boiler, en boiler engineer. Yeah. Well, that didn't oh. work. I pass. Pipe's too short. Right. Can we combine them? Oh, yeah, there we go. Pipe, pipe. Pipe. Ah! Can we use... Well, that didn't work. There we go, on the bypass. So, now... There we go. Because that's where I keep my keys. In the boiler. So... Hmm. We got through that puzzle quite quick, so let's... Uh... Hey, that was all you, that. Yeah. I think the noise got to me out oh, oh. But boiler. Boiler. Good song, Limp Biscuit. Very good. Boiler key. Okay. Is it always oh. Hey. I like how it makes that like I'm the knobhead because he can't use a key oh, on the door. Okay. Oh! No. Scary that one. Jesus. That new one. After several nails. <laughs> yeah, he's right. a tough bugger. Anything around here? We just go out the door. Examine the lava. No, don't do that. Right, can I eat that pizza? Can I put the wood plank on the floor? Well, that didn't work. Oh, man. Don't mock me. You think it would? Um, it's a wooden plank. We'll save it in case I fall in. The floor is lava. I was literally thinking the floor is lava. Too easy, but it's got to be done. The floor is literally <laughs> lava. Right. Uh, but can you just walk back a minute, Alice? Let's, let's take in the scene. Is there anything from here I can... I've got the planks. So I feel like we're going to have to fashion some sort of bridge. Makeshift raft. Doesn't seem to be anything I can click on in here. Not those three, uh, those six dots. Turbine scream and a high pitched whine. Yeah, just seems to be the main. Must be like the main power generator for the lodge. We walk. The hot molten lava has melted this section of the floor. Anything around? No, oh, no. So you can't just walk over it. Because that's a stupid idea. Hmm. 
let's uh, have a try of the. Uh, not must have to be the plank or something. <gasps> Maybe I need. Do I need another one? Ah. Oh, oh, is that sure. melting my plank or? No, that's fine. That's, that's no, melt, it's, just melting yeah. the bank. Oh, bugger. Now walk it. Oh, right. So I need a couple of planks. So let's let's go back and let's see if I can find <clears throat> any more planks. Because we were in we we're in it's the just, room with the two masks, and I've we've gone through there, and it's kind of taken us here, but we've not. Just keep an eye out for planks. Nothing. Nothing around here, is there? Oh, Can you use that? Like a... Oh, that's the one we knocked off before, isn't it? Um, you can't use that to like build it with uh, the plank that you got. How's that door locked? Um, that's the door we came in, isn't it? Or do we have to turn the... Uh... Oh, we can't turn that valve off. Hmm. Oh, um, can you pick up the brick? Battery, no. Battery. Ah, it looks like one of those bricks. Can I... Now I've taken the pressure out of the boiler, can I now turn this valve? No, it just says it's stuck solid. Hmm. Have I got the... Hmm. The flags? Are they used for something? Maybe lay, lay the flagpole. Well, you wouldn't really have much room to walk, would you? We could try it, but. Um, hmm. There's something in here we've missed. Can I use the, the wrench on the generator? Well, that didn't work. Well, that didn't no. work. Can I use. Can I use the axe to cut the wires? Or the meat cleaver? Yeah. Could we? Okay. Damn it. Ooh, could be like I'm an idiot, Steve. Hmm. Come on now, there must. Must be a way. Go on your list a minute, Al. Right, so we got that wooden plank there. Yeah. Can you. Mm. Lose that with. Uh, oh, the two man. flags? No. Okay. Well, that didn't uh, work. Damn it! I definitely, well, you definitely have to put it down. But I, I think I just need another one. Can I? Or can I? Are, are we still on a plank right now? Yeah. Do I put the plank down? Go across? Pick up the plank behind me? Oh, try it. Right. Nope. There doesn't seem to be. Let's try the old it's shake. Gone. Oh. Damn. So, it's so it does melt after a while. Um, hmm. We can't get back out. I wonder if the whip comes in handy in your situation. I think a lot of these are just weapons, though, to like fight your way through. We can't like, interact with anything around here. Well, there wasn't much in here, but there must be something. Um, go back to the lava a minute now. So, if you noticed, um, in the second like tube yeah. thing, there's a little piece of wood there. With the cursor's on now. What if you walk? It just says part of the lava. Part of the lava. Damn. I was gonna say you couldn't rest the wood on it. Mm, no. Hmm. Let's go back and have a look at this, and if we get really stuck, we'll consult a guide. 
that's that's the one advantage of playing all these games years after 25 years after they came out is that everyone that got stuck the first time has provided the knowledge for right, but when they got stuck in the 90s and they look back and watch it but they, they just stopped cards, playing so. they were just no yeah hi um so welcome back sorry about that so after being stuck there for quite a while uh, we had a look online and it turns out that we'd inadvertently locked ourselves in um so um we luckily managed to find a cheat code where you can basically warp to any point in the game so rather than us quickly start the whole game again and, and fly through using a guide um we managed just to put ourselves back we've got the same inventory i think the issue was the uh, the mask puzzle that i was dicking around with that i accidentally solved um opened the secret door and the issue was we didn't pick up the th uh, three planks that we needed. So we were right for the solution of the I puzzle. Think we jumped the gun a bit. We were a, yeah. a bit excited. So I won't say we cheated by locking it up because we were right that we needed Just all the planks. Out, really. But we're backstage now at the little theatre area. It doesn't count as cheating um, anyway. So we, I didn't want to edit it out, but I think for the sake of viewership yeah. um, and for our sakes, it just... You wouldn't want to sit through no. me staring at my phone for 10 minutes googling um, and then get a lot of swearing. A lot of swearing, um, folks. So we'll save it now because I haven't actually made a save. Um, got wood. Well, just. Finally, we got wood. Let's try that one again. Right, Time so. 16. Luckily, all the puzzles that we've already solved are already solved. Um, this, this is where we try and go back and find out that we can't even get in the place, so. Let's uh, we didn't check this room. Oh, get us chainsaw this zombie quick! Yes. Right. So I've, I've just used all my chainsaw gas. Does that say cancer station? Yeah, complimentary coffin nails. Oh, nail gun. I don't think I think it's a uh, Can we cigarette. Pick thing. The fire extinguisher. Right. So I've just used all my things, and that was useless. So. Great. So we only need planks. So I've just used up. So I have to switch back to the. Uh, is it the scythe I had? There it is. Hmm. Stephanie's claws were gone, but now they're back there. Okay. Oh, no, they were there. They were on the other side of the room. Ah. Right. So let's try that again. So we did all this puzzle. And now. If I, we, we were confident. We, ki we killed this guy. So let's... And now we have to be quick. Yeah. Because it does start to melt with the lava. Yeah, so let's walk over here. Quickly. That's not melting, no? Oh, I went too far. Oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> my heart went there. Oh. Oof. We're just going to rage quit and we just won't finish the game at this rate. Just, nope. <laughs> we'll right. have counting after this. And never so this we won't go ever. in that door and I'll save my chainsaw oil. Gas, whatever you call it. Um, so let's go through. And this time. Not this not this time. In a second. Any minute now. There we go. So we'll use this plank on the lava. And then this plank on the lava. And then we'll quickly go. Run! Run! Come on, Steve! Ride like the wind. Come on. Yes. Save. 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 Oh save, God. save, 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 save. Steve, you bastard. Just call it Steve, Just... you bastard. Jesus Christ. Steve, you bastard. Oh. Steve knew then. Steve yeah. knew. He's like, what? Oh. You mean just go gently over here my own oh, time? No. I thought they were Cement with his then. The remains of the less fortunate initiate. Right. Oh, was the door there. The ceiling's moving. Cement base. Oh no, he's gonna uh, flag poles. The flag poles. Yes. Quick. Well, that didn't work. Yes, it did. Put it on there. Don't Quick, the other one. Oh, right. Well done. Will that stop them? Will that? Are, are they gonna weigh enough to like hold it up? I hope so. Huh? <gasps> oh, we were nearly a jail sandwich. Oh no. <laughs> You're very bold for approaching a man with a chainsaw with a hmm. nightstick. This looks like the rope to level three. So, we're going to save I'm it again. a minute now. Because I believe this could be the final part of the game. 
but let's find out. We, there might be another 10 hours yet, especially the rate we're going. Yeah. Um, level 3. No no clever up puns there, just, just it's level this is, 3. This is, this is raw, this is uncut now. Oh. We're probably like, that's probably Stephanie who were murdering her by climbing up the ropes. Yeah, it's actually it. attached to her neck. Yeah, right. That door's locked from the other side. Oh, what's that little... Some nails there. Oh, yes. Right, some more nails for my nail gun. So we'll... Uh, see what, we'll equip the scythe. Oh, wow, Steve, you've been battered, mate. Let's have a sandwich. Oh. There you oh, go. Happy. Yeah, Life's, anything's better oh, than a sandwich. Excuse me, Steve. Divorce, breakups, loss of sandwich. limbs. Have a sandwich. Who, oh. Whoa, He's had who's a few this? sandwiches, him. This is the temple of the mystery of abstinence. Do not eat of the food or you will be punished. All within are hereby bound to a vow of abstinence. Yeah, we'll abstain from whatever it is. Um, what is there. that guy? Can we talk to him? This is the temple of the mystery of... <gasps> I, I wouldn't piss him off, Al. Um, just... What? I'm not... <laughs> I'm all out of clever... Clever names. Has he got a? Is he eating with a ball gag? And I just have to wait for him to finish. You obey well, initiate. Oh. Better than your brethren. They have eaten and grown stronger for it. As promised, I will not punish you for your obedience. But they will. They will. Oh, oh no! He's El He looks like Elvis. He's short, fat Elvis. Did Elvis die? I'm gonna kill well, this guy. Just as well, standing there, like. Oh, no. oh, oh, right, so we killed a fat guy, but we won't kill him. So lesson learned: know your limits. Yeah, know your limits. It's getting intense now. Right, let's let him. Actually, no. Keep... Hang on, he's got one hamburger left. No, we're just gonna chop him up now. Oh, I thought he could like have a hamburger. Right, can we talk to him? You obey well, and yep. You just kill your mate, there, pal. What are you gonna do, buddy? I don't think he's too arsed. What's in here? Oh. And some mothers complain that their children don't come to see them. Um. Shocked. Yes. This is the mystery of motherly love. Everyone says motherhood is fulfilling, when in reality, it's draining. I don't think your children are supposed to eat you. No. I see what you mean. You don't know the half of it. <laughs> what is this? Children are parasites. That's what you've got to understand. Sucking the life out of you. Your very life's blood pumping from your belly through obscene pink tubes into their thieving hearts. And even after birth, they keep leeching the life from you. Creepy kids. Of course, my children are better at it than most. Is that the bliss of motherhood? That's the mystery. Just what the world needs. More greedy little mouths to feed. Children suck the life out of society. They have to be protected, nurtured. Everything has to be childproof and rendered childish. Sadly, they'll suck the life out of you too. You too. Is he going to right. fight me or what's he doing? Pipe down, you little shit rag. I mean, Steve doesn't. Okay. Oh. Nah, mate. Not a chance. Oh, I was cutting. Come on. Oh, there's three of them. Yeah. I, I, so okay. at least they've got manners. So you did teach them well, some well lessons. Right. If I was the other two, I'd be like, fair enough. I, I'm not going to mess with the man with a scythe. If I'm honest. Has she got no more to say? Do you need just help? Just kill her. Put out her misery. I don't know if I can. I don't. Ah. Uh, oh. Yes, no, you just did. Okay. Right. That it was. was it was the right thing that to was do. The thing. Oh, ah. Is he doing shadow puppetry? Welcome to the temple of the mystery of religion. The mystery is thus. Those who preach love and mercy and God... Someone's squeezing him. 
are often those who call for the death of heathens. Do you believe in God, my son? I just saw a woman eaten by three kids, yeah. so not anymore. <laughs> yes, I believe in God. You are wise. His mercy anoints us all. And where doth he dwell, the Lord? In all of us. Yeah. Heretic, oh shit! You have not seen the light, my son. This is where I die, isn't it? But we shall open your eyes. Like he's got a little cross on his forehead. If we must shut them first. Come at me! Come at me! <gasps> Get him! Oh, he cut his head off. Um, there's two. Are they is he horses use... or cows? Have we seen the big testicles on them? Oh, <laughs> the udders. I I think. Think. Oh, oh, wow. There was a lot of guts in him. Right. Still, well observed. These receptacles are... Right, so you're going to describe a box as a receptacle that's symbolic of the promise of ultimate fulfilment, and yet... A stool. A stool. Um, they say bollocks. No. Massive, no, udders. big, huge. I thought they were bollocks then. Um... What times two? What, what do we just watch? Just utter confusion. Right. What door do we even go there? through? I'm... Oh, someone beat it to it in this one. The rem rotten remains of two children. Lovely. Do they have any keys in them? The gas can. Oh, gas can. Oh, we filled up the chainsaw. Viciously disemboweled. The ashes of a campfire. What about the medal on the wall? Oh, we, oh, cool, we've eaten. A nicely framed medal of honor. Oh, that's that's not kind of big old. Oh, wait, no, there's rotting corpses around. Yeah. What's around here? Oh. What do you want here? I'm just passing through. You think it's that simple, huh? Just passing through? Well, my family was just sitting around. And look where it got them. That's why I'm passing through. What of it? Oh, you did. My country paid me to kill. And then when I came home, I was out of a job. They expected me to stop? Cold turkey? Is that what they wanted? A paycheck today? Jail cell tomorrow? Am I a criminal or an entrepreneur? Hey, let's find out. Yeah, let's... Oh! Come on. What's this, Steve? Come on. Come on. Yes. You find nothing yeah. usable on the body. He did have a knife, to be fair, yeah. so... But I've, I've got a scythe. Scythe beats knife. Yeah. Knife. Not nice. I like oh, it. Is that <gasps> Temple of the Mystery of Flesh, Steve? Have a bite. Get him Mr. Back. Potsdam? The mystery Mr. is Goddamn. Less. Sometimes you have to lose some meat to get some meat. They would let me true. in until I demonstrated my worthiness. My invitation came after I buried Karen alive. That showed initiative. And her spinal cord was your Take it in, right? Yes, but to be initiated into the mysteries of the harvest, I had to do one last thing. I let them into the house and into Stephanie's bedroom. Was that her Sorry, order? that's no. not my department. Now I am a butcher. You should have gotten your dad to hire me on. That way, you could have been the boss instead of the prime cut. Try me. Are you sure that? Oh, wow. There? Yeah. Come on. Are you, are I've got a scythe. I don't care. <gasps> we'll choppy choppy his peepee -pee if we have to. There we go. Mr. Knott's dam. Oh, yeah. Give me some. Right. Give me some. Yeah. Cool. Right, we'll save that there. Mr. Knott's dam. We'll just call it Father Ingo. That's one of the best names I think I've ever heard, actually. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm fired up. I'm fired up. I knew I didn't like him. Right. That door's locked. I'm glad he's got... I, I feel more relaxed that, that he's gone. That door's also locked. Now. We just go back, won't we? So these seems to be like temples of mystery. Oh. Hello, handsome. Looking for a good time at a reasonable price? Yeah. Sure, I'd love to get it on with the ladies. That sounds like someone who's never been to a brothel before. Trying to pretend that they always go to a broth with a bunch right? of skanky whores. Nah, we'll be nice All to right. him. That'll be two hundred dollars. 
Well, lucky for you, I happen to have that exact right. amount. Go on, Steve. Cool. Oh, that killing must be a that's not a lady, that's my back. Oh no, it's a lady's back. Right, Thanks cool. By, that was quick. <laughs> you have Crystal, though. She hasn't been I didn't well. pick her. Oh. I'd be sure to get to a doctor if I were you. Oh. These diseases can have pretty horrible effects, you know. Fantastic. Right. Thanks, Crystal. Can I just kill her? Put in the ST in Steve. Come right. on. <laughs> just kill her. There's a hand mirror on the floor. We'll pick that up. And then talk to the madam. Can... Killer. Right. Get out you had his meat sword, now I have his actual sword. <laughs> <laughs> Bang! <laughs> Alright, okay. Has she got any like medicine on her or is the madam gonna help? How's that for head? Hey, I'm 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 yeah. on fire. A trite mirrored ball. Um Oh hello. Ooh. Talk to Welcome Dark. To oh hello. <laughs> and am I not beautiful? Oh, you are. oh yes. Look at my hair. Black as a moonless night. Look into my eyes, deep pools of desire. Look at my complexion, pale white and glistening. Gonna turn to an woman. Um, nah, no, she's actually pretty. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll flatter her. She's bit up herself. But uh, you're not that. Your hard, lips are like cherries. And yeah. All right, love Jesus. Uh, your hair is like silk. And what else? All right. Here's a mirror. Oh yeah, we got the mirror. See for yourself. Oh. Oh no, look at me. Do you see that? I'm fat. fat no, you're not. Fat. She's stunning, her. That's right. How sharp are her nails? <laughs> this is where she's going to get, you know. Where? Am I not beautiful? You um, still are, to be honest. Yeah, if anything. You know when you see a fit zombie and you're a bit yeah. like, eee, but. Mm. You feel the pain from the hooker's disease. Oh yeah, we need to sort that out. Um, can we go out this way? What about... Uh, Hang on, that's... This is where the the mother was eating the... Oh, we have to go back round? Sugar. Oh, I think we have to go all the way back round. Right, yeah, we went through this way. Butchers right next door to a brothel. Right. Standard. Can you... Uh, oh, you just let me past. Welcome, Initiate, to the Temple of the Mystery of Pain. The mystery is thus. The simple manipulation of nerves may break one man and yet leave another unmoved. The physiology is the same. All nerves sing alike. Yet the results differ. The question can only be answered by paradox. Although the body functions according to the tenets of science, the invocation of pain is an art. My implements are simple things, like a painter's brushes, from which beautiful complexities spring, different stories brought forth from different canvases, with the different application of a stroke. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> to torture this man on the table to explore this blessed mystery yourself. Otherwise, I'll have to teach you the lesson myself. You feel the pain from the hook. I've already in pain right now. Oh. Oh, shit. Because the... Right. His health still went down. Oh. Right, so, we won't sleep with the hooker this time. We saved it just before. So let's go through here. They're always like... Oh, no, it's through that way, isn't it? So... With a bunch of skunky holes. Such is the mystery of lust. So often the instruments of lust, as all instruments of higher pleasure, are condemned as frequently as they are sought after. I'd go on about the hypocrisy of a hedophobic society, but I think I'd rather just kill me a man. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> ah, she's got the whips there. Not anymore. <gasps> you... Alex, what? Do you know what we have to do with a man to torture him? With him. Oh yeah, I've got the whip. Oh, I could just kill him like I've killed everyone else. Mm. Right. Now, sorry love, but uh, we need to get through. Welcome. Yes, yes. Oh, you, don't you're kill not that harsh. You bastard! Oh. Uh, oh! <laughs> sorry love, but... 
You're in the way, right? Welcome, initiate, to the temple of the mystery of. Yeah, 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 yeah. My <laughs> Just completely unnecessary yeah, video clips. Have... Right. No, I think he felt pain. I don't. What was a syringe on the floor? Oh, Vaxi. Oh, maybe that was. Yeah. But because I had to loop the way around, yeah. I ran out of time. But. Yeah, come on. Is he dead yet? Nope. No, he isn't. I think I overdid it a bit. He felt pain. Um, we're uh, we're going. Ah, we'll get rid of him as well. Ah, you can't. Yes, you can. Oh, no, no, you can't. Oh. Do not pick <laughs> on the blind. To the temple of the mystery of charity. What mystery is there in charity? For God's sake. The mystery is the. I think these are like character tests for Steve. Yeah. It's like lust, there's violence. For They're all violent. Pain. Exchange. Charity. One must take from another, and one is always left the poorer. Not two hundred dollars. Didn't you give it to the hooker, didn't you? No, because we reload the oh, safe. Yeah. This way you'll understand. Yep. You see, though I am needy, I do not consider myself a beggar so much as a taker. I require charity, initiate. Give me something. Hundred dollars. I do have some. I've got two hundred dollars. Oh. Oh. I don't have anything. Charity is a loathsome lie. The only gift that keeps on giving is death. Good luck trying to find me. Dong. Oh. He, what's he got? His. <laughs> Get him. I love how they just explode. Like it's so needlessly over yeah. the top. Oh. This is the temple of the mystery of mercy. You're just in time for our little retirement ceremony. As part of your echo is this room. You'll be required to execute them. That's how all the people are disposed of at the lodge. And each member is expected to do his share. Should be pretty easy. Yeah, he's confident <laughs> now. But by retiring there to advance yourself. Hold. They're begging you for mercy. Do you grant it? Um. Yeah. If I grant them mercy, I'm gonna have to fight him. No. no yeah. Man. No mercy. But they are a sweet old couple. Yeah. Oh, you've got the to do it then. The mystery of mercy. Life is a competition, and mercy a perversion of the natural order. When you extend mercy to a competitor, you give him a second chance to beat you. Right, I think I'll, I'm not, I'll save it. We must be near in the end. There can't be too much left. Um, when in Rome. Kind of. It still works. It's still a yeah. Right. Can you come a bit? There we go. Was he going to get up and... <laughs> right, done. Alright, we'll just leave then. Cool. Okay. Oh, we're back here. Oh, I think I went out the wrong side. Let's go through here, through the brothel, past where she was, through the pain man, the pain man, through the blind man, to the that way. Oh, <gasps> ah, that was TV station exec. Oh. Christ, I saved it. Right, nail gun time. And I'm going to have a sandwich as well. Oh, yeah, have a good little sandwich. What do you think's on the sandwich, Al? Um, it's harvested. It's probably like a cat or something, isn't it? Right, we'll chop chop up the uh, pensioners and then... We'll oh, God, yeah, he is yeah, bad, actually. A let's have a sandwich. And let's get the uh, nail, nail gun, gun out. Ready? Yeah, oh, loads of nails. Right. There's 15 there, isn't it? Sorry, Romulus, can you move out of the way? Right. So, I'm getting Max Headroom vibes from this. Yeah, is it? Mind you, Max Headroom was like a satire of that kind yeah. of TV, wasn't it? I wasted a lot of nails yeah. there fighting, literally nothing. Oh, shite, man. It's an Alec! And I've. I'll quickly chainsaw it. See, as have you. What are you doing over there? Oh, oh what? <laughs> He's got you. There we go. That 
was odd. Oh, which door right. should he go to? Right, I'll save it because that was a, a tough room. That one. Mm. I'll save it on a new save. Max head gloom. Max dead room. <laughs> that was better. Oh, who's welcome to the inner sanctum. Hey, it's the principal. Guy. Principal Harold. Within the inner sanctum, you will address me as Vice Muck Harold. Vice Second Muck. in command to the Grand Muckety Muck. He of the Fed. The Grand Muckety Muck. Him, the secret handshake. The funny passwords. Only fitting, given that my role has always been that of an educator, and Harvest is one big classroom. What, what do you stuff? mean? You'll, You'll have, have to, to kill me to find out what he means, means big guy. Deal. Uh, ah! Everybody kept calling him big guy. That was quick. But, uh, well, he's a, he's oh, a big, huge bastard. God, this is hard now. How much actual health have I got? I'm a, I'm a battered still, is that what? Oh, Steve, mate, you're getting your ass. I've had all your sandwiches. Oh, uh, oh that... no, that still works. Yeah, yeah. Is there anything else I can give him to uh, make him feel a bit better? Whip him. I think the scythe might be better than the chainsaw. It's got a longer reach. Yeah, because you don't have to go too close to him. Then. Yeah, I probably should have used that on the robot. But... Welcome. Yeah, 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 yeah. We we'll have to kill this guy. <laughs> oh my god! You just want one shot, and he. Um. I might have to magic myself up some ammo or something if I can't beat this uh, dude. He used all my nails. Did I, have I not picked up any more shotgun shells? Got one. That won't be enough. Unless you just need one. Because if he's one shot... No, I don't think it'll be one shot, mm -hmm. really. We can try the... We'll give him the syringe. Which does bugger all. It's like he always one it kills you anyway, like... Oh. oh, the game just crashed. Right, we're back. So, we had quite a big issue where basically the game crashed and then we tried to load it. It came up with the enter password screen and then it basically corrupted all our save games. So, I had to consult um, the Lord Google and um, I found some old cheat codes online which worked, kind of like we used before to get out of that mess. Um, it seems like the programmers just got to the end of the game and went, right, bollocks to this, like, I want to go home at four. I don't think they um, want us to finish the game. No, so, we, uh, we've got, I had to do a cheat for all the items, all the weapons, uh, I had to do a cheat to basically get us to uh, this third part of the lodge, and then I've just <laughs> spent the last five minutes sprinting through to get back to where we were, so, let's try. All for you, folks. Just for... We're coming up towards the end now, <clears throat> so let's uh, try again. So we need to kill this guy who keeps killing us. I believe in Steve. Principal but we're, we're fresh as a daisy now, yeah. so yeah. What do you mean? Right, we need to kill this muppet. Oh! Oh! Kill both okay, of them. Okay, then. Off your foot. Right. Yep, you're definitely on a roll now. He deserved that. He deserved it. All guns blazing. Oh, hello. Oh. <laughs> a doll. Ring the bell and win a prize for the lovely lady. Don't do it, Steve. Or is it win the lovely lady as your prize? Oh. Enough games. Agreed. He's not even touching that one. Oh, hello. There was a little bit of nip there. <laughs> not gonna lie. Of course you do. 
there are no such things as monsters. And yet, you've killed monsters. Everything in the harvest is just slightly askew. This is because, as advanced as our technology is, we cannot make the sim any better than this. It was a simulation. Subject's subconscious always warps it in unpredictable ways. Sam? This is nothing more than a virtual reality designed by the harvesters to test potential members. Having successfully completed the program, you have earned the right to become a harvester. Work out in the fields. What the hell is a harvester? The hand that grips the knife that stabs. The ones who move amid the crop and harvest the fruit. You're talking about people, killing people. Again, and again, and again, I believe the technical term is serial killer. The harvesters seek to perpetuate terror and discord for our own purposes. We do this through the random utility of murder, and we persevere through our recruitment of initiates like yourself. You want me to become a serial killer? This entire reality has been engineered to break down your resistance to desensitize you to violence. Now you may become a harvester and re-enter the real world or stay in peace with young Stephanie and spend the rest of your life in the construct known as Harvest. What is the real world at this point? Right now, you are suspended in a sensory deprivation tank wired to a VR tech. If you don't join us, we will terminate your life support and you will be dead within minutes. Those last minutes, however, will seem like a lifetime lived in harvest. You will marry Stephanie and die peacefully of old age. You're presuming a lot. Aside from you, she is the only real person in Harvest. Suspended in a tank, jacked in just as you are. I assume you'll want to spend time together. If I stay. Of course. Having completed your ordeal, you may leave with her as you intended and enjoy your victory. If, on the other hand, you wish to join us, the cost of exiting the Lodge is the same as the cost of entering the Lodge. A skull and spinal cord. Well, I guess it wasn't going to be yours. <laughs> no. You couldn't kill me. These harvesters, they put people through this torture to give them a taste for killing. The way to beat them is to deny them. To live out your life here. With me. You're thinking about killing me, aren't you? Didn't you hear what he said? I do exist. If you kill me here, I'll die for real. And I'll feel all the pain, all the terror, because I'm real. Well, after all, what's a murder without pain and terror? 
Right, what are we doing? Do we, uh. So, do we kill Stephanie? And become a harvester, which means we get to go back to the real world and become a serial killer? Or, do we not kill Stephanie? We die in real life, but we live out the rest of our days in harvest. Now. I like the little town of Harvest. I did till we Apart ruined half uh, of it and burn yeah. it down and kill people. And but that's the thing: if we do that, are the characters going to come back and haunt us? Well, they're not real, are they? They're a simulation. So, <laughs> but then again, not. Mm. If we go with oh, saving Stephanie, I have we... saved it right at the end. We, so we can watch both endings, right? So what what should we do first? Should I say become a murderer? Become a murderer, right? So does that mean we kill Stephanie? Right. So kill Stephanie or marry Stephanie? Is there a difference? I do. Right. Let's I, kill Stephanie. Oh, but we spent all this time saving her. <sighs> Sorry, I missed. <laughs> what am I hitting it with? This is horrible. Please just die! Just die! Oh, please! No. <laughs> I take it back! I'm, I'm missing it. I can't. Kill him! Kill him instead! Oh, there we go. Oh, shit! Did I. I think I should just skip the ending. <laughs> right. We'll try that again. That's why I called the save. Let's try again. So don't click too many times either. We'll get a shot in on him first. Cool. Well, I, I wouldn't mind seeing these guys die again yeah. anyway, so... Right. <laughs> Skip you. Skip you. Kill Stephanie. And this time... I just want to relive this. No. Sorry, love. It's really horrible. <laughs> Stephanie, Come stop on. it. Stop screaming, please, love. Just whack it in the head. I'm trying. I'm, I'm after to take it slow it's because last time I clicked to too many times and we skipped the ending. There we go. He just sub zeroed her. How happy he is. That was neat. Welcome to our order, brother. Where are you going? Nowhere. Nowhere at all. What are you doing, Sam? Playing Harvester. That thing? I looked at it the other day. The very thought. Breeding serial killers. It's disgusting. It's cool. You'll rot your mind playing games like that. Don't you know people who watch violence become violent themselves? That's bullshit, Mom. No, it isn't. Why do you think they started cutting the violence out of those Roadrunner cartoons? Roadrunner cartoons? <laughs> Roadrunner cartoons? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
Did we eat Stephanie? Right, so that <laughs> that was Harvester. Um Wow. What an emotional journey we have been on. <laughs> Tell you what we'll do. If Min takes us. Um is that the full, one thing you took castles. away from it? Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Texas. Okay. So, what we'll do, we'll uh, we'll load the save again, just so we can kill the principal mainly, and then we'll try the uh, the other ending. Um. Yes, 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 yes. I love getting a cheeky shot on him first. It's crashed again. So fantastic. Um. <laughs> so. <laughs> Of course it would. Of course it would crash. So basically, um, <laughs> we uh, we did so well. We we got through ninety percent of the game with with zero issues. With that that last ten percent, it, it's um, because even the game knew that we were close. So that that's we the crash close. that we had before. So as always, it's corrupted the save file again. So it is something to do with using cheats because we had to cheat your way out before because the game locked us out. Um, so. I am going to edit a bit now, and we're going to pull up the ending on YouTube, and we're going to watch it that way. So, welcome back. So, I've just uh, edited in a little bit. I just wanted to kind of see what the good ending would have been had the game not crashed and corrupted our save for the second time tonight. Um, and you're, sp you're supposed to be um, setting off soon, aren't you? So, it's uh, been very good. So, we've managed to find the... Um, the good ending on YouTube. So we haven't watched this yet. Um, is so, it really a good ending in Harvester? Oh, well, we'll, we'll find out. So it's, obviously <laughs> it's lower quality than it would be from uh, capturing, it, capturing it directly from our PC. However, at this point in time, we've finished the game. We've seen the bad ending. So yeah. I want to watch the good ending and then we can discuss. Hmm. And then we can uh, bring an end to this series. <laughs> ordained minister as well Gotta be a better way to develop these serial killers. This is scientific. You want we should go back to the old way? What old way? Good breeding. <laughs> so that was the um wouldn't class that as a good ending. Not really. Um let me More just flip back to our regular scene. So Oh god. Oh we so oh. I've started it again. Right, I'll we'll play in my head then. So that was Harvester. Uh, yeah. Eventually, after some technical issues, but we um, we did we got through it. Um, we only had to consult a guide a couple of times, um, and then we had to basically uh, delete our corrupted save and then cheat to get to the last level again. But it just goes to show we were literally right at the end, yeah. and then the game corrupted. It's um, as if it knew. That we oh, were definitely. Um, added drama. Added tension. So thought. thoughts. 
I, I haven't got a thought so far. Um, this is the first time I've played anything like this. Um, obviously, I've seen you play games like, uh, is it Treasure Island in the past? Yeah, so I've played games like Monkey Island and Broken mm. Sword, and like, yeah, I, I'm quite well versed in um, a lot of video games. Mm. Uh, I'm a big fan of the point and click adventure games, uh, expect, which is why I suggested that we do this. Yeah. Uh, I hadn't ever played this before. I was vaguely familiar with it. I saw some clips a few years ago. I'd, you see it come up a lot on about uh, violent video game lists and, and weird video game lists and things like that. So it was always something I wanted to sit down and play myself. So being I, able to actually go through the full experience. See, that's interesting because I went into it completely blind. Yeah. I had no idea what the story was about. I haven't even seen the trailer. Yeah, you haven't. Yeah. Uh, and going in, the first half an hour, I really liked it. Because I like... Anything, if it's a movie, if it's yeah. a game, where the characters don't tell you anything, but it's got like an intriguing plot where you're obviously in the 50s, but everybody's acting strange. Mm. There's been a couple of films like that that I like. And what drew me to this straight away in the first half hour was how everybody was acting. Yeah. And we had no idea what the hell was going on. Not at all. Um, There's a part of me that, um, when they kept referring to the lodge, I thought, oh, okay, so we're going to build up, finally get to the lodge, and it's going to be like a lavish sort of uh, room. Like Different rooms are going to represent different things, but I didn't yeah. expect it to be quite like that. The wasp woman was shit. Yeah, she was absolutely um, useless. I don't know <laughs> if it was... Um, shit. I, I don't know if, if it was some uh, something we might have missed. Um I thought you would have come back into it as like the main boss, the bad guy. Yes, I think, but then again, it might have just been one of those, ooh, one of those red herring types where yeah. it kind of you, you think it's going to relate more to the story than it actually did. Yeah. Um, either that, or or maybe there was originally more to do with her, um, and and maybe she was. Maybe scenes were cut or parts of the game. It happens a lot. The same yeah. as films, obviously. There's, Things get taken out last minute or editing, or especially with with where a game like this is made with the, uh, the the using the real actors and the CGI. Like you, you don't know what could have led to no. the character being a little bit useless. Um, and the TV studio wasn't really much copied. Well, I suppose it was kind of obviously. I think the uh, I can see people would watch the first half hour hour of the game and dismiss it as. Yeah, senseless violence. But I think, uh, particularly in that last sequence, uh, the game is a lot smarter yeah. than it first lets on. Obviously, Definitely. there's a big parody of, especially for the time as well. Obviously, if you think mid nineties, so um, the I can't remember what year the BBFC. I think in nineteen eighty two, the BBFC came in, and then that's the British Board of Film Classification okay. for anyone who's not from the UK. So that rates. Uh, they used to rate video games and movies, but then the ESRB, which is the Electronic Software Ratings Board, I think, um, so there was a lot of kind of censorship around, particularly mm -hmm. games like Mortal Kombat, uh, Night Trap, uh, where there was a lot of legal lawsuits. So to have this early on in, in kind of modern video games, um, it tackle something as video game violence within a video game yeah. and have a, there's a self-awareness to it which was miles ahead of its time. It, it, it scarily rings truth now. Oh, yeah, even, even still, I think things still get blamed for... If, if there's a mass shooting, then obviously yeah, they, they try to blame... They blame video games. Yeah, they try yeah. to blame Columbine on Doom and Marilyn Manson. Mm -hmm. like it's, yeah. So it's a lot smarter than I think... The writing um, was fantastic. Oh, the yeah. acting in places... Yeah. Not so much. But... You, you can tell they used the same voice cast to do some yeah, of the voices. Yeah, and... um, I believe it was quite an expensive game to make. I well, imagine it is with all the technology it, they would have used. But... The sound design was excellent. Yeah, the music and the sound was, was brilliant. brilliant. It was really well made. I, I like the um, the style of it. because I felt like I was on a sort of murder mystery. I felt uneasy but comfortable, if that makes sense, all the way yeah. through. I like the... Um, like you mentioned Mortal Kombat then. Obviously, I'm not very well knowledgeable yeah. about games. But the early stuff I've seen of Mortal Kombat, where they they have that that computer character. Yeah, it was the same the sort real... of thing. But what they do is they yeah. take still images and they put them together. It's like a rotoscoped type of animation. I, I, I so, really like that um, to it. It gives it a weird creepiness. Yeah, um, I felt as if I was trapped in the the game. 
It is mm. very oddly hypnotic. Oh, definitely, um, definitely. But yeah, I, I really enjoyed it. I hope everyone yeah. watching bared with us for when we got stuck yeah. with puzzles. They probably knew the answers to. You probably pulled all your hair out by now. Yeah, um, uh, believe me, we nearly did after the game corrupted our save. But we oh. we managed to get to the end. We didn't get to see both endings in full clarity, so I had to go to YouTube. Mm -hmm. But we got there, we experienced it. Um, and it was what one hell of a ride. Yeah. Um, it was brilliant. We I will, absolutely loved it. Uh, we will be doing another game. Mm -hmm. uh, we haven't quite decided yet. We have some ideas. Um, I don't want to say what they are, because obviously mm -hmm. I don't want to say, oh, we'll do this and then decide against it. Um, but I have some ideas of, of I'll say, similar. Uh, I don't know... Obviously, I highly doubt there's anything that rings too true. Will we need therapy after them? We'll find out. Um, I don't know if there's anything quite as gory as um, this See, sort I of think thing. For me, the gore was fine. It was it yeah. was perfectly comical. But when they brought in, obviously, the, the hanging... Um, from, yeah, the, uh, the more Ed realistic Man. kind uh, of yeah. stuff. Yeah, and obviously the, um, the dead girl... Yeah, I thought, wow, it's which uh, apparently you can save her. We found out the other day. Yes, uh, if uh, certain, mm. which is what I quite like about the game. I think that was quite advanced at the time. At certain days, if you go to certain places, you can see you see Mister Potsdam trying to bury her, and you can save her, and then that's how you get the reward money for that mm. puzzle. Um, so you can buy the wrench and the tape, and then break into the barber shop. Um, but unfortunately, the fate of Edna. <laughs> Um, and she also takes her daughter along with her. I believe there's a slightly alternate scene where she also watch, hangs actually. her daughter. So it was it's probably better that we didn't see a child getting hanged. Yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, we will be uh, doing this sort of stuff. Um, we we won't put a date on it. Um, we, we need to properly decide on what we're going to yeah. do next. Um, we will be putting out some other little sketches when they're films. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching. And Yeah, uh, thank you very much, folks. We will hopefully see you soon so thank you